What's up guys, as you can see right now, we have 100 booster packs of Chilling Rain right now. Um, pretty much these came out with Elite Trainer Boxes, Blister Packs and Booster Boxes. So I've got various different products, so we've got various different pull rates. Uh, so yeah, let's see what we're going to pull, what we're going to get. Obviously we opened three booster boxes early, we did two videos with the pre-release kits. We did one video early with the Elite Trainer Boxes, so we showed you all the products and all the pull rates already. So now, release day today. 100 booster packs obviously we go in we go hard if you're new here make sure to like and subscribe uh if you want to see more we have more openings i've got another booster box to open as well and plenty of more products of chilling rain to come so if you want to see more of this set definitely subscribe here but 100 booster packs guys let's get into this video it's gonna be sick yo what's up guys in this video obviously we mentioned it in the intro we have 100 booster packs of chilling rain and yeah we're gonna go straight to the rare you guys the release day special went in I'll tell you in later on in the video how I managed to get all these products, but boom, straight away, no hits. So we'll just pass that and then boom. So obviously we had ETBs, we had blister packs, we had booster boxes to get these packs. So various different promo products, various different products just to get these packs. So pull rates can be anything so far, two packs, no hits. Uh, but yeah, we'll go through it quickly. Obviously 100 booster packs, uh, don't take too long, but okay, Tapu Fini, Holo Rare. We'll take that, we'll just put that there. It's gonna be a huge pile of bulk. I think, what, what's available, what's good in the bulk, my guy said, I can't remember what's good in the bulk, but guys, let me know what you, oh, Cinderace as well, straight after that. Let me know, release day today, let me know what you managed to pull, what products have you been opening today on release day, happy chilling rain release day, everyone. So yeah, let me know down in the comments what you pulled, what products are you opening, or what products have you got on order waiting to come, but come on, why the code card's facing the wrong way? It's probably from the blister or the ETB, I can imagine. But, oh, nothing there. Let's go. Alright, so Amphros. Alright, code card there. Oh, what's happening here? Alright, there we go. Come on, we need a banger so far. So far, bunch of hollow rares. Just hollow rares, no Vs. So just a bunch of holo rares so far, no V's, no V-Maxes, no secret rares, just a bunch of hollows. So hopefully in this we can get some good pulls, but yeah, we've opened the booster boxes, we opened the ETBs, we showed you the pull rates out of everything so far, uh, like individually before release, like two weeks before, it was the first people in the UK to open a booster box, and correct me if I'm wrong, maybe, because I know Randolph said in his video, oh, we got Rainbow Rare, hold on. Karen's Conviction Rainbow Secret. So I'll get on to what I was about to say in a second. But boom, guys, let's go. First, um, Hyper Rare or better, a Rainbow Karen's Conviction. So, yeah, not too bad. We'll take that. But yeah, I know Randall saying in the UK, Europe, the PR company doesn't really gift out to influencers here. That's why, obviously, you'll see in America and Australia, all those PokeTubers have got products early. But over here, no one really got it unless you had a plug to buy it early no one was really gifted it in this uk or europe so yeah i had to get my plugs to go get that product early open three booster boxes early managed to get the etbs early so yeah guys make sure to like and subscribe because we don't let you down on the early content we've been getting early like every release now but the pull rates are tough guys yo so once we done the first road that would be 20 we'll go through how many pulls that was or how many um pulls hits we got out of that but there we go zero aura V will take that. Let's go. Code card. And I got a new light today because my other light, my usual table light that I got from my brother, actually broke today. So, um, well, the other week. So that's actually broken. So I got new light. So if I block the the light there, I'm ordered a new light. But yeah, let's not get into that. But we got zero aura here. But I'm not too bad. Regular V again. I'll take that because we're not getting too many hits. But yeah, new table lights getting ordered, so we'll get a better light angle. But for now. So we can pump this content and put it, bring it, get it up for release day. I'm just using a big, um, what you call it, softbox light. I'm not sure the name of it, but yeah, it's just shining over my shoulder and it's getting hot. But boom, ah, bro, let's go. Come on. Why is the pull rate so, so tough on this set? Everyone's telling me in the description, in the comments, tough pull rates. We've got white code and it's just a hat trend here. I heard these Cresselias might be going for a bit as they're a little bit playable, so 
I think Aiden said they're like five, ten pounds for the holo. Uh, I mean, the reverse holo Cresselia. Well, you can check sold listings and see if he sold it at that. But he said they're a bit playable. That's why. But Serena there. Come on, guys. What is going on with the pull rates? And last one. So that'll be 20 hits or 20 packs, and nothing there. So out of 20 packs, we got two. Ultra is a better, so we got one regular V, one rainbow rare, which isn't too bad, I guess. But then we did get four holo rares, so six hits out of 20 is not the greatest, guys. But obviously, all the packs are shuffled up, they're all from various different promo products. It could be literally whatever pull rate. So let's get through it, let's see for every 20 how many hits we're gonna get. Uh, but let's get into this. We got Volcaran over there, non holo. Hate when the code cards face like that. I wonder what product that comes from when the code cards are facing the wrong way. But, ooh, Agron there. There we go, code card right way. Because they're all shuffled up, because obviously I took the big thumbnail. I was counting how many packs, but, oh yeah, Shadow Rider, Calyrex, VMAX. We'll take that one, boom. Let's go, we'll take that. But yeah, all the packs are shuffled up when I'm counting up the videos. So we've got 100 packs here, and then we also have 36 packs for a booster box. But even in the booster box, they're going to be all shuffled around from ETBs, blisters and whatnot. Because I was just counting them up and then seeing how many packs we have for an opening. Because basically, we went down to game today and got some of these uh, score money on the ball promo. So if you're in the UK, go hit up game. If you're not in the UK, go visit my eBay link in the description to buy yours. And yeah, we buy those so it helps kind of pay for the products, etc. So yeah, that's why I had a very like a large assortment of different products. I was mean, doing this with the EVs when the EVs came out before it was even a thing. Like, so we've been doing this, but yeah, you know, we always have a step ahead of the curve. And yeah, we got a bunch of those as well. So yeah, make sure to like and subscribe, guys. Appreciate all the support in that. But Galarian Zapdos, so well, let's go. Boom, Galarian Zapdos. Let me know what your thoughts are on this one. What is your favorite birds? Let me know down in the comments, guys. Being released, I'm interested to see what people are going for, what people are buying, what pe people are trying to pull. But, oh, that is the rare. I thought that was a reverse for a second. But that is the rare. All right, it's real tough, guys. I don't know. Maybe this is probably normal pull rates. Who knows, but we'll just go through it. There was just a holo rare again. Galarian Ronarigas, but yeah, come on. All right, ooh. So yeah, guys, what are you going for? I'm trying to get the old art birds. I'm trying to get the rainbow Metagross. I'm trying to get the rainbow um, Celebi. No, we got the rainbow Celebi. Well, I wouldn't mind doubling up on that, but ooh, Blissey V. So yeah, uh, rainbow, and then Blaziken, rainbow Blaziken. And then we want to go for the old art for my collection. The old art birds mainly. I'm not sure if I'll keep any of the Cataraxes. I didn't play that expansion of the game, but the rain, uh, the Galarian birds, obviously being the legendary birds in Galarian form, have to keep some of those. But there's Cinderace Hollow there, so yeah, which I think about six cards will keep some of the regular V's as well. Uh, I'm not really into the waifu hype, so I'm not going to keep any of the trainers in my collection. I'm a very selective collector when it comes to collecting. Anything I like, I keep. Anything I don't like, I'll sell it on eBay for you guys to purchase. So if you want to buy any singles that you see today that I might not be keeping, they'll be on my eBay later today or on the weekend. But, oh, first time pulling an Ice Rider Calyrex card, guys. I've actually not pulled an Ice Rider Calyrex card before. So Ice Rider Calyrex VMAX, let's go. Wow, I actually not pulled this. So we'll compare the two regular VMAXs together. So there we go. Yo, let me know, Team Ice Rider or Team Shadow Rider? I kind of, I know I like dark vibes, etc. and stuff like that, but the Ice Rider does look a bit better. But the problem, only thing that lets is like Ice Rider down was the Silver Lance set in Japanese was just dreadful. All right, come on, guys. Let's see what we can get here. Ooh, nothing there. Come on, just sweat. We're doing a fast opening, if you know me, and my fast openings. We go straight to the rare, and yeah, if you want to see more of this, I'll do this pretty much with anything over 30 packs. Alright guys, come on. So, um, almost done 40 packs, guys. We'll kind of reevaluate everything at the end as well. Kind of see how much, what the pull rates are saying, obviously, again, it's from various different promo products. So the pull rates are anywhere and anything. If you want more secure pull rates, check out our booster box openings. They give you a nice average, but there we go. We've got Metagross here. If you know, Metagross is one of like my childhood favorites. So boom, we'll take that. So boom, let's go. And then boom, we've got Scollipede there. And then code card for that. So again, 
nothing too crazy in second row out of 20 more packs but there we go third row another 20 booster packs we're just flying through this uh, guys make sure to like and subscribe don't think i was making a discussion earlier with my mate who uh, does anyone in the uk i'm just curious obviously i know there's a lot of americans that open tons and tons but even most of the influencers american influencers we might even open more than them but oh weevil here do we do we open the most out of all the uk based uh pokey tubers let me know in the comments guys i'm actually curious about that i was having this discussion with a mate previous to this opening or prior to this opening all right come on. so yeah let's just see what we're gonna get we're gonna pull wow pull rates are dreadful i was hoping like we got 100 booster packs here i can hopefully add quite a few cards to my collection this way but it doesn't seem it's gonna really help but well, luckily i got those promo cards uh from obviously game which helps kind of pay for this kind of thing that's what i'm saying buy oh yes metagross v max we'll take that we i think we pulled the full art before so we just need the rainbow rare to get that like collection but left to right centering is a bit off so uh, i'll think about keeping that one but metagross v max you guys know i like it but yeah boom let's go oh blissey again this one's gonna haunt me i know this one a lot of people it's not going for too much not many people are fans of blissey uh, the Blissey Alt Art is a lovely, lovely card. We did pull that in Japanese in one of our box breaks not too long ago. But yeah, I wonder what the English value for the Alt Art is because it is a lovely, lovely card. The Alt Art, but yeah, let's see what else. There's a Zero Aura Alt Art which actually looks incredible for an Alt Art. But I just got to pick and choose because there's so many cards in this set. If I want a lot of cards, then I'm gonna open a lot, a lot of packs. So I'm trying to keep it a bit reasonable with this set because I'm the, I want to. We're going to go hard with Evolving Skies when that comes out. I want to do about 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 packs in a month for Evolving Skies and just add multiple cards to my collection. you got Rayquazas, you got Evolutions in Evolving Skies, so that set should be very promising. Hopefully, the pull rates will be a bit better because, as you can see, it's a bit tough. Look at that. Just flying through these. How many green codes are we getting? But, boom. Oh, we got Lycanroc there. Can't bear hollow rares though, so. What do you guys reckon? Oh, Glaring Slow King. So many hollow rares, guys. What? The hollow rare listing on eBay is gonna be insane. So, obviously, if you wanna complete the set, we will have singles on our website. We've got Leopard here. There we go, Leopard V. So, we'll take that. So, boom, let's go. Oh, Zangoose there. All right, come on, go luck. But yeah, guys, let me know what you're opening today. What are your chase cards down in the comments? I'll obviously comment, like, heart, all your comments down below, all the positive comments, keep positive in the comments, obviously. But bruh, I don't know what we're doing with the pull rates today. That was a green code, obviously, holo rare there, but I wanna see Vs and better, not holo rares, you know what I mean? Obviously, I appreciate the holo rares, but again, only one secret rare. We went through 60 booster packs couple of these couple of v maxes and the rainbow secret rare so the pull rates are kind of tough guys but that's same we kind of got the same pull rates as we would have if we got one sealed booster box so kind of sticky but we do have plenty more packs i've got a booster box to open after this one as well guys so let's get through this let's kind of go through it and yeah keep it nice and sweet video for release day if you guys uh we do this a lot we did shining fates we did 100 booster packs a couple times now i believe Champions Path, 100 packs a couple times. Viva Voltage, we might have done like a three box opening. I might be wrong. But I might have it recorded and not uploaded. So we'll try and upload that AS ASAP. But Sandaconda V. So boom. Someone said if you put it upside down, it looks like a thingy. But I don't want to say what it is. But yeah, let's go. We got Sandaconda. Someone said that in my last video. Well, that might have been with the VMAX one. So we'll try it with the VMAX one when we get shot. Oh, full art now. First full art, yeah. We got V Maxes, but and we got the secret rares, but no regular full art. So, Volcanion full art. So we'll take that. Obviously, I think we pulled this one before, so not too bad, I guess. But yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. Porygon there. Boom, Shaman. Oh, well run. So guys, we 100 packs, so the four pound average pack per price per pack 
four to five pounds because obviously promo products work about a little bit more. This video is probably going to cost me 400, 500 to do. Will we get that 400, 500 pounds worth of tools out of 100 packs? Let's see, guys. This is why sometimes it's better to buy singles, and I'm kind of leaning that way. But obviously, I want to deliver you guys content. My enjoyment comes from opening packs and not buying the cards. It's pulling the cards myself. So that's the problem with me. I'll, I'll probably lose money, but at least I enjoy it. <laughs> enjoy losing money. But yeah, let's move this pile. But yeah, we need to pull some waifu cards. We want to pull some seeker rares. Hopefully we can, guys. But yeah, we got a rapid strike Urshifu here. So boom. The old Sanaconda again. But some people say you're getting green. Whoa, that green doesn't look normal. I swear these greens look a bit off. Let's see. Yeah, the greens do look a bit off. Look, these are um, this is the normal green. This is the new green. So, um, yeah, it does look. Some people saying you get green codes like a normal green code, and you you, do, you get pulls. So like you get code like this, and you can get a pull. So it's a bit broken at the moment. So who knows? That might be affecting the pull rates a bit. But uh, yeah, keep an eye out for that, guys. People on my Discord been saying they've been getting white codes and getting no hits. So luckily we haven't been able to done that in this video, but we're not getting too many hits. So I don't know what's going on with Pokemon Company, but ooh, wow, this is a super OC. Look at that code card there. But look at the centering, guys. Yo, ah, back is not too bad, but yeah, let's go. We got a Metagross V Max, so not too bad again. But centering, I want to add it to my collection, but that's another thing. I could pull it, but will the centering be worth keeping? So obviously my end goal is to grade it, but there we go. We got Blaziken V as well. We'll take that out. That's a more normal green compared to that. So yeah, you can see the code color difference there. Uh, maybe different products, different batches. You can tell from the color of the code now. Um, but obviously it does vary. It's always random. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just a bit shocked with the pull rates in the moment. But yeah, just obviously just waffling through this now. Almost done. Almost done 80 booster packs, guys. So yeah, boom. Let's go. Alright. And the 80th one now. This is not pack number 80. Do you think we got about money's worth of pulls? But ooh, the scolipede there. And yeah. So that is 80 booster packs, guys. So yeah, make sure to like and subscribe. Obviously, we're making this content for you guys, going hard for you guys as well. But as well as I always open and enjoy opening, but I always just slap on the camera so we can create content at the same time. So if you appreciate my taking the time to record these videos, to edit these videos, just make sure to like and subscribe. We're not too far away from 9,000 subscribers now. So if you guys can help me reach that, that'll be incredible. If you already subscribed, appreciate it if you want to tell your friend to subscribe i appreciate it as well but yeah come on so this is the last row now hopefully we can get at least one secret guys like 100 booster packs not even um like a few secrets only one secret that's a pretty mad still and we haven't even got any old arts we only got one full art as well this is like booster box for it so yeah i'm gonna stick i'm gonna stick to maybe just booster boxes or booster packs of these sets uh, I do have like the promo cards, the blisters and stuff, and the sleeves from the ETBs, but even then... Oh, there we go, we got honey! Let's go. Alright, let's go. Obviously, honey, was this the one that was a promo in Japanese? I'll put the picture there if it was, but... Let's go, honey, okay, we got a waifu, is this a waifu card? Are you guys feeling this one? All right, we got another full art. At least that's good. We managed to pull a full art before this ended and just not a bunch of bad hits. But okay, I just dropped it. But we got a Blaziken V. Let's go. Obviously, you know, I love the Blaziken V from my childhood games. I played Leaf Green, Diamond of Pearl, and also Emerald. So those three are my like childhood, those three games in that era of Pokemon. Did have some cards before that. Had like base set, jungle, fossil, just a couple cards, probably mainly from the, the decks that you, you could have got in Woolworths, etc. But yeah, let's go, let's see what we can get. But yeah, I don't think, I don't remember recall opening booster packs when I was a child, but that's because it was probably too expensive. Four or five pound a booster pack, whatever it was then. Even a couple quid was expensive when I was a kid, but come on, let's go. Oh, well, we're in there. 
Put in that. Okay, another waifu card. Doctor now, let's go. Now we're getting a pause. Now we're talking, guys. Yo, Doctor Full Art. So we'll take that one. Not get, got, It's going decent towards the end now. Come on, hopefully there's a few more. Obviously, it's all shuffled up. I've been doing the thumbnail, which was putting all the packs out neatly. And then I was counting them up, making sure the counts could put another Blissey. Why can't we get a Celebi? I haven't even seen a Celebi today, so... Come on, where's the Celebis at? Where are the old art birds at? Come on, let's see. Almost done, guys. Almost 100 booster packs. I see full art again. And zero aura full art. Yo. How we're talking, guys. What is that? That's like three full arts. Left to right, shockingly bad. Yo, this is OC as hell. The back's not too bad. I don't know if they'll give it the OC grade, but... You can see the centering is real bad there. Obviously, the full arts are kind of hard to see with the reflection, but I do like the lightning here, the purple with the orange around it. It does give it some depth of field. A bit of detail there. Obviously, some of the full arts are pretty bland in the background, or the contrasting colors don't match really. But this stuff works well, purple with the yellow, and yeah, a little bit lightning there. So yeah, zero aura there. Let's go. O OC is held though, but at least another full art. So I knew... We'll get, we'll eventually get a couple hits, but come on, let's see what else we can get. That's crazy, we pulled in three full arts and out 20, so that's good. But boom, nothing there. Nothing there. And final pack, guys, we'll just run through it. Guys, smash the like button, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, and the final one, nothing there as well, so not too bad to be honest i would say you're better off buying sealed booster boxes instead of wasting time getting the blisters the etbs the pool rates are not guaranteed in anything but the booster boxes in my opinion but yeah we've opened three sealed booster boxes the pool rates have been consistent throughout but what we got these two full art trainers we got this zero aura or canyon full art and the karen's conviction then we got a bunch of v's and v max to be honest i think we've got a lot of pools but just slacking on the full arts maybe maybe mainly the secret rare only one secret rare out of a hundred booster packs which is a bit crazy uh but like i said is there a random sample size like random different products and i like to do it like this way you could end it up with like five secret rares it could be totally random you never know but yeah release day happy chilling rain release day to all of you guys hope you guys managed to get your products you wanted to get i hope you guys managed to pull the cards you want to get or yeah let me know what you managed to pull what cards you're going for what cards have you pulled what products have you pulled down in the comments let me know but if you're new here make sure to like make sure to subscribe so about to open 36 packs right now so guys if you want to stay tuned for that video this will go live probably next week so stay tuned make sure to like make sure to subscribe and i'll see you then peace I'm not afraid to